Hi friends, I hope you've had an amazing week. Thank you for joining me today. I'm so excited to do something really fun with you. All right, so week five, we've learned all about how we can be helpers, but guess what? There are other helpers in our community that also do amazing things to help others. So I've got some pictures and I'm gonna take them out at one at a time and I want you to help me think about who the person is, what they do to help the community. All right, here we go. What does this person look like? Yes, he's got a stethoscope on. You're right, this is a nurse. Very good. And a nurse helps us when we are when we're not feeling well, right? When we're sick, a nurse can help us feel better or just to go in for a checkup, right? So, so cool. Very good. What about this picture? What do you think she does? She also has a stethoscope on and a clipboard and she has a long jacket on, it's white. Where do you see that? Normally, a person wearing a white long jacket. Yes, she's a doctor. Very, very good. And what does a doctor do? Yes, kind of like a nurse. A doctor helps us feel better, right? A doctor can help us when we're sick. He can give us shots when we need shots. Maybe just, just for a well check. We go in for well checks and the doctor can help us make sure that we are good to go, and that we are healthy. Very good. What about, what about her? Yes, she is a teacher. What does a teacher help us do? Yes, a teacher helps us learn. Isn't that incredible? A teacher helps us learn all different things and it's amazing. So when you get to go to school or if you're already started pre-K or if you're going into kindergarten, oh my goodness, it's amazing. Or if maybe even if you're in daycare right now, right? A teacher helps us learn in so many different ways. So next time you see your teacher, give them a fist bump or an elbow. All right, let's see who's next. What about this guy? You're right. He looks very familiar. Who is he? It's Justin the Mailman. Yes, Ollie's friend, Justin the Mailman. Yes, very good. He's a mail carrier and a mail carrier helps us bring our mail. So when you go down and you open up your mailbox, guess what? Mail carriers help by putting our mail safely until we can get it, right? So, so amazing. What about, what about her? What does she do to help the community? Yes, she's a police officer and a police officer helps to keep us safe, right? Helps to keep our city safe, helps to keep all of our friends and neighbors safe. Yes, very good. What about this guy? You're right. He is a firefighter and firefighters help keep us safe just as well, right? Just like the police officer it helps us keep safe, right? And if there's ever any fire, the firefighters are sent out to help control the fires, right? Put out all the fires. What about this guy? Does he look familiar? Yes, you're right. He's Ollie's friend, Luis. Yes. What does Luis do? Luis is a handyman and he helps take care of houses right? So amazing. Yes, he uses different types of tools to help take care of houses. So great. And what about her? Do you recognize her? 
She's in our story. Yes, her name is Tabitha. And Tabitha helped by making clothes for people that needed them, right? She's also a community helper. Wow. Thank you, friends, for joining me today. You did an amazing job of helping me figure out how these people helped our community. So there's so many different ways that you can also be a helper. You can leave a note in your mailbox for your mailman or maybe something sweet to eat or maybe a drink on your on your porch for UPS or Amazon deliveries. You can leave notes for them as well. You can uh, take home baked cookies to your police officers at the police station. You can go visit the firefighter stations. You can do that too. And maybe you could take them something too that you can you can you can make them like cookies or maybe you can take them something really special too. Um, and teachers as well. Make sure that you're emailing or maybe maybe typing in messages to send to your teachers or maybe writing out a letter or maybe drawing a picture for your teachers too to show your appreciation for them as well. And our doctors, right? Doctors are incredible people. They are, they keep us safe and they also keep us healthy. And it would be really amazing too. You could always write a letter to your doctor too, thanking them for everything that they do. All right, friends, y'all have an incredible week. We'll see you soon. Bye-bye.